Welcome everybody, welcome to Rocky Desert, my name is Mentorius and welcome to Mentorius Factory. Well, that's the biggest part of the factory. In the last episode we did a lot of moving, we did a lot of building and normally around episode 4 we would have copper production and cement production all work out if it wasn't for us moving everything. So we are going to do the copper production today I guess. So let's get started and let's get working and uh, let's have some fun because well we are going to do a lot of work today and it's making a new factory hall for the copper production, the cable production, uh, kind of a lot of production. And well in the last episode I find out I had the music kind of mute so I put it a bit up so that we had some more music and maybe I need more cement production. I definitely need more product cement production. I kinda need to find out how to set this up all because this factory hall is kinda big and it's one two three four five big and yeah we kinda want to do something kinda the same. I'm definitely going to need two cement productions, so that's what we're going to build next, so that we get at least two cement productions, because I am needing a lot of cement, because every plate, everything you see is cement. We need cement for everything. So this factory is going to be one, two, three, oh man, I'm moving an overload five long so we are going to build yes we cannot can move it beneath it oh man I love the music I'm definitely loving the music it's amazing this game is amazing if you haven't already checked out our stream I'm streaming with WT on the Wednesday and Sunday Saturday he is not in the building and that's when I'm creating chaos on the stream so if you want to see something funny go check out the stream for now we're building this factory in rocky desert we also need to explore this land because this this is one amazing piece of land so I was saying we are going to build two constructors and uh, no I'm not going to call them workers anymore they are constructors and I need to call them that way why why can't we too steep how can that be too steep that's kind of strange that it too steep the floor is too steep hmm all right and the next one is going to be next to it but i need more space or i need more i mean more cement ah, this is horrible uh, let's make the second one I kind of want to have it exactly next to that one, but I cannot afford it. I need reinforced tail. All right, so let's first connect this one again, just to make sure. I cannot afford that either. Oh my God, you got to be joking. I need plates. I need a lot of plates. Lucky I got a lot of stuff already produced. As you can see, my factory is running and it's running over time. All right, let's build the second constructor. It's going to be kind of oh, um, oh man, I'm totally dim, dim lost. I'm definitely getting lost. Let's first do that one. Get the construction plates or the reinforced steel, and then we're moving. So that's why we need our second line up and running. I need the copper and after that we are going to move to the second floor because we got quite a production floor in this area where we can do well a lot of stuff. We're going to make the screws there and some other neat stuff. If you got any comment on how I'm building this factory, if I should do anything differently, well Leave it in the comment down below because I love hearing of you guys. How I should do this? What am I doing wrong? What what could do? What could we do better? 
Oh, this isn't working already. <laughs> I'm already seeing this. Why this isn't working? Mm. All right. Put one power pole between these two. Well, we kind of put it exactly in between. That would have been nice. And that one also connect it. And then we're going to put them on. <laughs> All right, these need to make concrete because we definitely are going to need that and this one also needs to make concrete do we got some concrete left biomass no limestone yes we do all right now we need a little 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 splitter a little bit logistic and i need to put it as close as i can and as you all know the splitter doesn't have oh great this is horrible place doesn't have you can place it exactly against the uh, oh well it did show the line you can place it almost against the worker but well i don't like the views of that it needs to look right that's also an important thing of factory everything has to look quite clearly and quite nice all right now i guess this factory hall is going to be one tile longer because i do need the storage container and after that we got well a lot of concrete to build the floor and now for the organizational part we are going to build a storage container Man, yes, and it's going to be in the corner. Well, just because we can, uh, we need a merger for this all to work. Thank you. And as you can see, well, you can put the belt just connecting everything. Oh, I need. I need more concrete. I need a lot more concrete. That's not looking nice. That isn't looking nice. That one looks good. And there is the concrete coming. All right, so in a few minutes, we should have plenty of concrete. In the meantime, we need to uh, get our copper production up and running. And I guess I want to look how much the smelters are producing, because if the smelters are producing overflow, as you can see, the biggest problem is the splitters. I guess this one isn't doing its job. Why? This is the only one that's full. That's interesting. And it's not because... Well, I guess it's because the first one in the line These ones should slowly grow full, but these are producing pretty substantial stuff. So I need to fix a problem in the future, how to produce more of these plates, because the splitters are damn slowing these uh, production lines 
And that, that's kind of the biggest problem. The splitter isn't fast enough. Wow. So we need to fix that because we only got one line of copper coming in here. And that uh, copper line will come down. Oh, down. No, oh man, I'm totally doing it wrong. We don't have that much time in this episode. I want to see progress. And then that one's going here. It's too steep. That's kind of shame. That's kind of annoying. I kind of want to have that one perfectly aligned. All right. Well, going to be a little bit more of a curve in that. Oh, this is kind of in the middle of the factory, and we're going to make two copper lines here, or at least well, two, maybe three. We can make three, I guess. Yes, we can make three. All right, let's see how much cement we got because we need to lay out the bottom section of this factory. Oh, and I fell down again. And I got big plans with this factory, so we need a lot of space. We definitely need a lot of space. Right, last line. And we're out of concrete again, as usual. But let's see if we can get this production a little bit up and running. I'm still not sure where to put these, uh, the uh, space elevator. The floor is too steep. I hate that when you put it exactly at the middle point, it will not place it. Kind of funny because I can place it in this direction and if I do it this way, it will place it. So. It, it definitely a bug, but well, there isn't much we can do about it. I need a little bit, a little bit more space. I guess that that will be perfect. Come on, put it that way, and yes, that's perfect. Oh man, my brain is running over time. I guess we are going to build a three lines of copper in this section. Let's see if we get enough cement to build the floor for that one. Uh, I guess that will be a close call. Oh, look at the view. It's beautiful. In the live stream, we build uh, well, a giant factory around the spaceport. It's, it's kind of funny to see. Um, maybe, maybe we are going to try something differently with this one as well, because I like to go into the heights and find the maximum level of the this this, this map kind of. All right, so this is now the biggest spot on the factory. Uh, we wanted three lines, so let's see, let's see. We got a new splitters, and we're going to split it. Wonder if it's automatically connected. I don't think it will. No, it definitely will not. All right. Now I kind of need to set up. Oh yeah, great. I'm going to hate myself for putting it exactly on on the middle line. But uh, well. 
Well, there's nothing we can do about it now. Yeah, we could change up the whole factory, but we're not going to do that. Oh, yes, I no, we're not needing a miner, we're needing a smelter. <laughs> funny me, funny me. No, I'm not funny. I'm definitely not funny. As you can see, it's again, it's too steep. Alright, now I need the power. So I guess the power line is, well, it's going to go this way. I want to set it up a little bit wider. Yeah, this is going to be the one. Then the next part will be powering everything. And then to give it all an order because I keep forgetting this that last part giving the order it's kind of important all right let's do another smelter that one is one away from that one so I guess this is going to be it yes it's the perfect spot then we're going to put one power pole exactly aligned Yes, perfect. And one more smelter. I guess that it, it it's a lot of space for these things, but well, I love to have my factory. I love to have a little bit of space. You never know when you're going to need it. And maybe we are going to make it so that we can walk under this, but that will come in the future because I don't have the stuff for that yet. Uh, let's see, let's see, another splitter. Right, that's one perfectly aligned. Now that one is. And that one is as well. Alright. Now to do the last part, power part. Or almost the last part and the copper part. Thank you. You as well, copper. And uh, one more power line. Perfect. Alright, it's all working, no power, no power, that's not possible. What did you connect to then? Oh wait a second, uh, that one needs to connect to that one. And that one needs to connect to that one, thank you! Now we got the copper production up and running. Now the next thing we need is uh, kind of a lot of workers. We need uh, three workers and uh, I want to have three of these. So that's going to be six reinforced plates and that's kind of the problem. Well the cable is not that hard to make. Reinforced plate is, reinforced plate is going to need screws. We can make those easy, easy. Uh, well, we kind of need a lot of screws for the reinforced plates. Right, and that's done, done, and now we can make the workers. I hope you guys can all imagine when this factory is all done, it's going to be beautiful. It's definitely going to be beautiful. Uh, let's see, we need workers. Uh, I need cement for that because I need more spades. Uh, let's see, we got 100 cement ready. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, and done, and done. Oh man, I love this space. I got a lot of space left, but... 
Well, I do realize I do need to make, make the cables and they will go that way. I'm not sure what we're going to use them for, but in the end, you need everything in this game. You definitely need any, everything and you need to explore a lot. I got copper ore here. I don't like having copper ore in my inventory. All right, now let's make the constructors. Wonder, yes, it does align. That's a good thing. Now I do hope that, yeah, we got enough space. That's a good thing. Ooh, we got a power problem. This is not right. How can this one be closer? I should have started with that one. Well, we're not, what, 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 what? How can that be possible? Hmm. I think we got a little problem here. Because if that one's not perfectly in the middle. Oh man. That one got space. That one does not. Oh man, I messed up. I messed up. I hate it when I mess it up. Because this smelter needs to move one little block. So let me be right back and. I I will have this all finished up and running. And after a lot of work, and I still see some red lights, so something not going right there. So we'll check that out in a few seconds. I have a three smelters with making copper uh, ingots, and one line is making copper lines. And the last one is making two copper lines. Why aren't you working? Oh, you are a program. Whoa. And the last line uh, is making the copper wire. Or the wire. And it is moving to this one. And this one is making my cables. So. I wouldn't be a great host if I wouldn't at least do one upgrade every level. As you can see, I already made a part of the factory a little bit. So this is going to be closed hall as well. And I guess within we need a few more. Oh man, that's going to take a few seconds. I can make that faster. We are going to launch another port and we are going to call this episode an end. Because I don't want to make them as long as we did the last time. The last time I was way over my time. I promised 25 minutes, 25 minutes. Well, it wasn't 25 minutes. It was way too much. But in the next episode, we are going to think where to place this starport. And I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode. Because I certainly did. And well, we're going to build this factory even bigger, bigger, bigger. And I hope to see you all joining me in those episodes so we can launch more of these pods so see you all in the next episode and uh, well i hope you guys all enjoyed put your comment down below because i really like to hear from you